Hello and welcome to Meek Hibiscus. I finally got a Switch! Yay! And I've been playing it lots and it's so, 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 so much fun to play. Throughout my time playing video games, I've always been a late adopter when it comes to gaming consoles. I guess when I finally decide to buy the latest console, there's lots and lots of games to choose from. I bought my Switch from a Black Friday sale on Amazon and I wrapped it up for Christmas. I also bought Super Mario Odyssey and received Let's Go Eevee as a present. Recently, I bought Super Smash Bros Ultimate. I found the Switch fairly easy to set up, even though there was no instruction book, just the setup steps on the side of the box. I plugged the screen in and followed the setup instructions on the screen. It showed the three ways the Switch can be played, handheld, tabletop and docked. I've mostly played in docked mode because the games I have use motion controls. Well, except for Smash Brothers of course. If I buy a case for it, I'll be able to take it away and play it in handheld mode. When I first played my Switch, I had trouble slipping the Joy-Cons onto the Switch. I couldn't do it very gracefully, like they do in the Switch commercials. Now I've gotten better at it, and they slide on smoothly. I wasn't too sure about the Switch's home screen. It seemed very bare and quiet to me, compared to the Wii U and the 3DS's home screen. However, it loads very quickly, and you can get straight into your game. An advantage the Switch has over the 3DS and Wii U is the ability to take screenshots easily with the capture button on the left Joy-Con. I've used this feature lots in Super Mario Odyssey and taken some wacky photos. I decided to play Super Mario Odyssey first and I played it with the Joy-Cons in the grip which felt comfortable to use. But trying to do the motion controls with Cappy was very difficult. So I chose to play holding a Joy-Con in each hand and I was able to pull off the cap throws a lot easier. What can I say about this game that hasn't already been said? Well, I'm glad I played this game first, as it's an amazing introduction to the Switch. It's going to keep me busy for years. Next I played Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I had to learn a whole new control setup by only using one Joy-Con. Initially I found it strange to move around using my right thumb to control the analog stick, but I quickly got used to it. Catching Pokemon using the motion controls is fun, but it can be difficult for your throws to be registered correctly if the Pokemon is moving around the screen. Or maybe I'm just bad at throwing Pokeballs. Overall, Let's Go Eevee is a terrific game that lets me relive some of my first ever Pokemon memories. So far, I've enjoyed my time playing the Switch, even though I've mostly played it as a home console. The first two games I've played have made it a worthwhile investment, and now that I have Smash Brothers, I'm sure to spend many more years playing it. Thank you so much for watching! What are some of your favourite Switch games? And what ones would you recommend a new Switch owner buying? Okay, see you next time! Bye bye